An infestation in the far reaches of the Northwest has residents in shock, and now they're looking into who may be responsible. 23 ABC's Mark Christian joins us now live from the neighborhood and explains where the bugs may be coming from. Mark? Well, Jackie, I'm standing on bugs right now, and I don't have a choice because there's not a spot where they're not. Now, it looks like dirt is actually dead ones where residents killed with pesticides earlier, but there's plenty of live ones to go around. Now, the bugs just showed up earlier this week and are literally taking over this neighborhood. Residents are calling it an infestation of biblical proportion. Not just in the thousands. They're in the billions. And they're all saying the same thing. Never in my life have I seen anything close to this. I've never seen anything like it. And these insects are everywhere. On the streets, sidewalks, on cars, on fences, in backyards, and on toys. Some residents are even fighting the insects from coming inside their homes. They're vacuuming, they're coming in through the doors, they're coming in through the windows. <laughs> which cause many pest control companies to be very busy this week in this neighborhood. Now this brown pile that looks like dirt is actually the dead ones, but the live ones are on the move. They're spreading all down the street. Down the street is right, and also up your leg if you're standing still too long. Oh, hey, I feel them crawling up me now. That's nice. We took a sample of the insects to Kern County Vector Control, who said they're cinch bugs, which are agricultural insects that feed off plant life and don't present an immediate health hazard to humans. They do not carry any diseases to harm humans. Um, they're more of a nuisance. Now this residential community backs up against agricultural land which hasn't been used in months. Pest control experts believe because the field is not presently being used to grow food, the insects came out in droves because no pesticides were used. There's no stopping them. They will, you know, kill a bunch of them and they're dead for a while, but then more just keep piling on top. Right now, the residents are just trying to figure out who owns the property. I want to know if they are going to be held responsible for maintaining it. Now, late today, the residents did get a hold of the property owner who came out here and checked it out and said he's going to do everything he can to get rid of the bugs so they can get their lives back to normal. Back to you. I have never seen anything like That's that. That's one of those stories that you just want to. Oh, gee. Mark. Gosh. Something's <laughs> got to be done. <laughs> yeah. Got on it, you, you watch. Oh. He's going to come back to work. We'll be fighting them yeah, all around. Yeah, they'll be all around. We'll have here. a new infestation. <laughs> you like. Uh, all right. Bigger.